So let's let's work something out here. Let's let's see. Here's this cube that I told you about, Chiron Zung. Okay. Now, Lord of Dispersion. He's also big into hallucinations, making things appear to be what they're not. This is all going to work out. Trust me. So when I went and looked it up. I got this picture here. Now this is a, a, a website for that particular thing. Here we see in the corner, we see there's two girls. This is Ishtar from Samaria. Here's the two lions that are normally shown at the bottom where the feet are. Okay, in invasive vortex. Okay, this is not a good thing. This is a bad thing. This means invasive. That's working on a very very low level like into the, your DNA type of thing here's your three three and three that's nine okay so it, it, in the true fashion of thinking that they're bullshitting somebody here's a logo three triangles is it or is it this is it really just this see you just connect the lines and there's the cube okay it's always the cube that's the same cube that's in the UN prayer room it's the same cube that's in Mecca it's the same cube that's on Saturn it's a, it, it's the cube okay now Let's look at the a logo for the guys. The guys that worship this are called uh, Thelemites. They're in the Thelema. Thelema. Kind of sounds like Selena because it's a female type of a thing. See? So here's their logo. Right here. And notice it's called the Unicursal Hexagram. Well, we know this is the seal of Saturn, don't we? Right? So it's a Unicursal Hexagram. And it, it, it's, it's the common symbols of Thelema. Right? Well, when we talk about illusion, because I remember saying this when the towers went down, I didn't know how to explain it, but I was telling people that what they were seeing is not the way that it was really happening, because it's an illusion. And that's why you can't pin it down, just like the Sandy Hook thing. Okay, it's like, it's like we're living in a dream time kind of thing. Um, it's, it's very, very, a very, the Bible calls it a very strong delusion. And that's what it is. So, let's just take a look over here at my next picture. Ah, here it is here, the Lima. Everybody thinks the towers were brought down with thermite. No, they weren't. They were brought down by thelemites because this was done <laughs> on a totally different level. Okay, it's thelemites brought down the towers, not thermite. Although they were close, they both deal with fire, okay, and burning up things, okay? And notice this is when the jet hit. Okay, can you see the eye right there? You see it? I just put the triangle around it so that you, you know, because here's the triangle over here. But there's the eye right there, same when it's on the dollar bill on the back, okay? It was the thelemites that brought down the tower, not thermite. What do you think it was fire? Just like Sandy Hook. A town burned right to the ground in a flood. Wow, I guess you don't need to call the fire department because they're already there. The real fire department, you know, the one from the abyss. Okay. All of this gold, all of this stuff you're about to sell your gold. The gold is always tied to the abyss. There's another picture. There's Saturn right on the side. You see it? That's their logo, Saturn. Because this is the seal of Saturn. And it also represents this. Okay, this is why one of the ones never want to be running my mouth about Saturn. Because it gives away the th Thelemites. The Thelemites. Okay? But I was smart enough to know when I saw this symbol on the ground that it only made sense that this cube went along with it and seems that their logo is this picture right here it is here's the circle with the X in it here it is on the floor I told you here and here it is here it's a cube okay so the entities are in the cube now let's take a look at one of those entities that's in the cube that I found interesting from their website. I haven't doctored any of this up. Here it is here. Okay, there it is right there. Right? So if we look, we can see that there's a guy in here. Let's take a closer look at this guy. Ah, there he is. See, he's got some goggles on his face here. See this? See this here? Okay, well this is the guy that's inside the cube that's affiliated with this thing and it's all got to do with the illusion so it was really the Thelemites those that practice Thelema 
witchcraft, whatever you want to call, call it, because the Bible clearly tells, tells us that their God is the God of the bottomless pit. And Saturn is called the star of the abyss. And this a-hole openly, openly worships the one-horned God, which is their God. There you go. Mystery solved. Congratulations. Way to go, dickhead. Now, if you want to go file against me again, pussy, I don't give a fuck. I told you I'll be off of this computer soon, but it was fun exposing your dumbass. So there you go. All of this is out of the book of Daniel. You can go read it. Here's the cube. That's why the cube shows up all over. That Donald Duck cartoon I had, um, I can't find it now. They took it off. It showed the cube flying through the World Trade Centers. I can never understand why. Now I get it. It's because these guys and their representation of hallucination is what brought down the towers or didn't bring them down. But you know that their rainbow memorial, rainbow Saturn, Thelema, uh, is two cubes. The Bible is even tainted as far as I'm concerned because the New Jerusalem comes out of the sky and it's a cube. So you know what? Go fuck all of you guys. Okay, I'm done with a lot of you. I know what you are and I know what you stand for. You were scumbags from the beginning and you'll be scumbags to the end.